And the tensions between Iran and Israel are not the only thing keeping the region on the brink. In fact, the volatile West Asia region might, might be witnessing another broad yet quiet war. In the latest, as per reports, a missile attack targeted a U.S. air base in the Conoco gas field in Syria's Deir al-Zor province. U.S. officials have stated that the projectiles did not strike the facility. The attack, allegedly carried out by Iran-backed militias, involved six shells landing near the base, prompting the U.S.-led coalition to respond with artillery fire. U.S. warplanes were also observed flying over the area in the aftermath. The targeting of multiple U.S. air bases in recent weeks points to signs of a quieter war brewing in the region. Note that this incident is the latest in a series of escalating attacks on U.S. forces in the region. Just last week, a drone strike at the Rumalen landing zone in Syria resulted in minor injuries to several U.S. and coalition personnel. According to the Pentagon, eight U.S. troops were injured in that incident. Earlier in the month, another attack at the Al-Assad air base in Iraq left four U.S. troops and a defense contractor injured. America's firm backing of Israel in West Asia and the increasing frequency of these attacks, suggesting that tensions in the region may be intensifying, raising concerns about a potentially brewing conflict involving Iran-backed militias and U.S. forces in West Asia. To stay up to speed with the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.